kitchen is the room in a house that is busiest and you may constantly find hectic morning activities here, such as when making breakfast or experimenting with your new exotic recipe. With that in mind, you should have easy access to every kitchen utensil, spice, and ingredient you need. Unfortunately, buying cabinets, shelves, and other kitchen organizers can be costly. Therefore, making them yourselves is your safe bet. If you think constructing kitchen essentials yourself is arduous, you will soon change your mind after watching these 12 wooden projects for the kitchen. As always, Simphome presents you with the list. Number 12. A Mud Kitchen Project for the Daughter at Dibamitsi Although it is not a real kitchen and you can't use it in your cooking space, this idea is still worth a try. At least you can make your kids happy and more creative. To make this mud kitchen, you only need a wooden pallet and some boards. First, get a wash basin and use its bottom to determine the hole size. Then, cut out your wooden board until you get a hole. Your wash basin is supposed to rest snugly in it. After that, use brackets to attach the board to the wooden pallet. Next, install the wooden legs to support the countertop. Then, paint the mud kitchen and install trims, hooks, and knobs. Number 11. Recycle Old Wooden Spool to Unique Corner Table from At Samantha Arsenault Like wooden crates, a wooden spool is also highly versatile. You can use it as a piece of furniture that completes the rooms in your house, including the corner of your kitchen. To create a corner table for your kitchen, you can dismantle your wooden spool. Then, cut one of the circular parts to fit the corner of your kitchen. Next, cut the other circular part into a smaller size because you'll use it as the base. After that, sand the pieces down thoroughly so that you can stain or paint the wooden spool, then assemble them. Still relevant to recycling, you know you don't want random advertisers to access your search privacy and then recycle that data to serve the highest ad bidder. For that reason, we offer you the She's Fine Search App, a search engine program with an internal proxy to block advertiser bots from snooping on your search data. If you think your privacy is essential, consider She's Fine to try. Until then, let's continue our countdown with number 10. From the hardwood flooring with all their flaws to a new kitchen countertop. First, you have to get hardwood flooring without beveled edges. If it is hard to find, at least you can purchase the one with the slightest bevel on the running edge. Then, install a subsurface of plywood so that you can staple the hardwood flooring to it. If your kitchen applies an L-shaped design, consider laying your hardwood flooring in a stair-stepping layout. After that, take another piece of flooring and cut it if necessary to give a more finished look to the counter edge. Next, sand the countertop thoroughly. Then, fill in the cracks with waterproof glue and apply two coats of varathane. Finally, use some pieces of flooring to create the backsplash. Number 9. The Floating Corner Storage Solution from Create Enjoy To start off the project, you only need some sturdy wooden boards, then cut them to size. After that, sand them down thoroughly before applying any stain or paint. Next, install heavy-duty brackets to the wall, then screw your boards onto them. Number 8. A DIY Drawer Organizer from At Bender Homes First, take everything out of the drawer to plan the design. Try placing your spatula or any long kitchen utensil into the drawer to determine the length of the box. You will also need to use a measuring tape to determine the height of your drawer divider. Next, get some wood strips and cut them to size. You will also need scrap wood to create a spacer that you'll use when assembling the pieces. Once the divider is ready, insert it into the drawer and nail it to keep it in place. Number 7. A project for your snack or gold bars. Project from At Woodhouse Studio. This ingenious storage is the best place to hide your favorite snacks from your kids or your treasure. Besides, it's a genius way to use your cabinet's corner space. To create these drawers, you need to install the drawer slides on the left sides of each box. You will also need to install drawer slides to the bottom and top of the cabinet to enable the boxes to move aside. Number 6. A Satisfying DIY Wood Carved Salt Cellar Project by At Tastemade This cute wood carve will complete the look of your dining table. It is much better than serving some salt in a saucer, besides, it's easy to make. You only need to trace the spoon onto the wooden block. Then use a half-round wood chisel to cut out the wood. After that, sand it thoroughly before applying sealant. Finally, place the salt into it and lay the spoon onto the notch. Number 5. A Recipe Stand Wooden Idea from At Moving with the Military Sometimes you need to reread the recipe during the cooking process, thus you'll need the recipe card stand. This recipe card stand is straightforward to make. Even if you're new to DIY projects, you'll surely nail it. 
you only need to get two pieces of wooden board. Then, screw them together. Consider gluing them before screwing to make the assembling process easier. Next, you can explore your creativity in decorating it. For example, you can add a bow tie made of a burlap ribbon. Then, attach a clothespin to hold the recipe of the dish you'll cook. Number 4. A mini kitchen garden idea from at Farmer Nick NYC. If your kitchen lacks space, which hinders you from growing herbs, you can try making this plant table. This plant table consists of two shelves. Each shelf can hold up to 16 different plants. You only need to create 16 4-inch holes in one board to hold terracotta pots. Make sure you stagger the holes to get better plant viewing. Then apply any finish you want before assembling the pieces. Number 3. A Kitchen Garden Project Idea from at Skylar Lace Has the previous idea not satisfied your green thumb yet? Try this one to grow more plants in your kitchen. You only need to create a wall hanger with cedar wood, then purchase several 6-inch plant ring hooks. Next, screw them to the board. Basically, your wall hanger is ready to hold your plants. You only need to hang it on the wall using a French cleat. However, you can always try painting your terracotta pots to match the design of your kitchen. Number 2. A Wooden Cover Stove Idea If you're not into cooking and barely cook something, you may find your stove collecting dust. You can solve this problem by creating a stove cover from tongue and groove pine. If you follow the plan successfully, you catch any liquid or spills from the cutting board, thus saving your time for cleaning. Before constructing this cover, however, remember that you make it from wood which is inflammable. Thus, do not cover the stove when you use it or it's still hot. Before we close out our countdown, we'd like to inform you that we have a YouTube video playlist titled Simp Home Finance Series. It lists not only our video productions, but also there you'll be able to access all kinds of information you can use to understand and simplify your home's financial challenges. We'll see you there, and until we meet again later, sometime in the future, let's close out our countdown with... Lastly, number one, another stove cover project idea, this time from at Nifty. Tongue and groove pine is not sturdy sometimes, therefore you can try to create this stove cover from plywood or cedar. The advantage of this stove cover is that it's multi-purpose. Besides covering your stove and holding dust at bay, you can use it as a cutting board and serving table. To enjoy the full version of the video you're currently watching, spare a little time to visit the link provided in the description. That's it for now, but before you leave, as a final reminder, you can press the subscribe button, continue with our finance playlist, visit Simp Home, or continue your research related to the particular topic using She's Find. Whatever choice you make, we appreciate every second you spend playing the video. Best of luck to you, your health, and your projects. Until we meet again later on a different day, thanks for watching.